First, I have to tell you that when I talk about things that are dear to my heart, I often cry. So <laughs> just bear with me if that happens to me tonight. So first, I want to thank Al Alice Galvin, who's sitting over there behind me, who was the person who nominated me for this. She's a longtime friend of mine. And I was really glad to have her here and helping me up to the stage tonight. So, second, I want to thank the many women of the organizations that sponsor the Alaska Women's Hall of Fame for all the volunteer hours that they have put into bringing this gathering into being. Then I want to tell you of all the things I've done what was the most fun? What I think is the most important? And finally, what I was most proud of. I started signing up for courses at the local college because many of them sounded very interesting. And they were. Classes with young students and involved and vital instructors turned out to be great fun for me. The disease of alcoholism is one of the most serious medical problems in Alaska. It is no respecter of wealth or fame and affects all populations in every city and village of the state. Police departments, the judicial system, and hospitals are all significantly impacted by the disease of alcoholism. In Sitka, the chief of police told me that the majority of their arrests are involved with alcohol. The, the Alaska Commission on Alcoholism, on Alcoholism and Other Drug Abuse and local counseling boards are all mandated with prevention and treatment of, alcohol, of alcoholism and other substance abuse. They work to treat the victims of this disease, counsel their families, educate the members of the legislature, fund fund existing treatment programs, and help to set up additional programs. The many years I spent serving on these boards, I can to be, consider to be the most important civic work I have done. <clears throat> Recently, I was asked what I was most proud of. And I knew that what I was most proud of is that my husband and I raised four real good kids. And one of them is here with me tonight. 